Hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough! Final boss time! Here we go, but not without some preparations. Because this boss could destroy everything you have quite easily. So, what we want to do here is have one captain take the yellows and to uh, face the boss, and the other captain protect the rest of your Pikmin squad. Um, this floor, you probably want to hide your Pikmin like somewhere around in here because uh, stuff is going to be falling from the ceiling and they can and it can hit anything in the room. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to try and get the Pikmin all situated somewhere where they won't be hurt. Which is going to be a hard ordeal. <laughs> what I'm going to try doing is like plop them up against this wall and then dismiss them and hope that they don't uh, scatter away from the wall. Okay, that looks that looks pretty good. I hope. But I'm, gonna, I'm still going to leave a captain here on this side just in case. Alright, let's go into the arena and always make sure you know where these uh, openings are so you can make a hasty retreat. Alright. I'm going to start it from this side actually. Let's do it. It's Louie! He's okay! Is that Louie? Mr. President, I have located Louie resting on a vast mountain of treasure. You have not located him, I located him. <laughs> For him to venture to these depths alone, the desire of man is a thing to be feared. But Louie is not moving. Could he have exhausted his strength in reaching these depths? There may yet be time. Quickly, to Louie's aid! Okay... Oh! 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 The final boss is known as Titan Dweevil! And as you can tell, it's not really doing much of anything until uh, you start attacking it. Well, it's got all four elemental types, so uh, here's what you gotta look out for. Its legs don't do any damage to Pikmin, so you're okay there. So you don't have to look out for anything. Oh, here comes a fire attack. <laughs> And if you want to dodge its attacks, just get out of the arena. But if you can't get out of the arena fast enough, well, you gotta keep blowing at your Pikmin so they don't die. The reason why I'm using yellow for this fight is because you throw them higher than other Pikmin, and because... Come on, get on them. And because of their electricity resistance. Because electricity is the only element that can instantly kill Pikmin. Purple time, so that means we got a poison attack. And yeah, it's, it, uh, it's a swirly thing like that. And by the way, the more you damage each of these uh, implements of death attached to it, there's four attached to it, by the way, um, the more that you... Come on, no. <laughs> the more that they get aggressive, I guess you could say. Oh, geez, this is not good. This is the thing that can attack everything in the room. So let's take a look over here and see here. Oh, yep, yep, I got some Pikmin there. See that? That is the danger of the Titan Dweevil. You cannot just, like, leave Pikmin unattended like that and expect them to be safe. The whole room is a danger zone. By the way, I should probably... Oh, poopers. I was gonna say I should probably speed this up by using a red spray, but uh, I think I'm just gonna wait this out here. No, okay, there we go. Throw them up, throw them up, throw them up! Yeah. Maximize your damage outputs! Yeah! Oh, oh, poopers. And here comes fire. Whoop! That was close. <laughs> As you can tell, it's a boss of patience. And hopefully, I'll be able to do it quick enough that it won't bore you. <laughs> but this boss can take quite a while to complete. But once you knock off a piece of it... Um, oh, yes, yes! Yellow electricity! That means I can throw Pikmin onto it freely because I'm completely immune to electricity in every way! <laughs> Use the yellow color to your advantage, and uh oh, monster pump. Yeah, each of these attacks has its own name. Oh, the poison one is called Comedy Bomb. Um, I forgot what the other ones are. <laughs> As a matter of fact, I probably shouldn't even be saying the names anyway because they're they're kind of treasure names. So maybe I'll just leave it at that, and we'll see the names when I finally get them. Sound good? Good. Uh oh, fire time! <laughs> That's a cool looking flame, by the way, especially in the darkness like this. Alright, let's get over there. And you probably want to aim for um, the water pump, if anything, but the water pump is on the back side, and yeah, uh oh. 
Uh-oh, water pump. But, yeah, you can choose what stuff to attack and... Uh-oh. Oh, oh, shoot! Oh, shoot! Mayday! Mayday! Okay, we're good. <laughs> Dang water pump. But yeah, because it's on the back side, it's a little hard to get to, and that's probably the idea behind it. Well, maybe it's not that hard to get to. It's... Oh, boopers. Oh, wait, wait, it's yellow! I can attack it! Uh, actually, yeah, there we go. And you'll notice that when you're doing damage to something, it will be shaking on the said thing that you're doing damage to. Oh, shoot, oh, shoot, oh, shoot. And yeah, it's got a, got a pretty good range, by the way, in case you didn't realize that. <laughs> so, uh, even its regular attacks are pretty devastating, hence why I'm always using uh, yellows for this, because they're the only things that won't be instantly killed by its attacks. Uh, where was the pump? There it is. Yeah, knock the pump off. Knock the pump off. Eh. Yeah. By the way, those spike balls will hurt captains, so uh, don't touch the spike balls because they're spiky. And yeah, this is going to shake them off soon, I think. Oh, comedy bomb. <laughs> and by the way, that poison reaches all the way across on the uh, bottom there to the walls, so it's not like you can just hang around there like far enough away from it. You actually got to get out of the arena. So yeah. Come on, come on. Oh, I just threw them everywhere, I, except on there. Well, like a couple of them got on there, but not anything that's uh, an ideal... Oh, yeah! I got the water pump off! So that means the rest of this fight should be a relative breeze. Okay, I'm going to leave that electric thingy there, and I'm just going to go for the fire, I guess. Because it is by far a bigger threat. Uh oh, comedy bomb again! <laughs> And luckily, uh, it, it stops immediately when it hits a slope, you know, it doesn't, like, walk up the slope. Uh, both the boss and its attacks, I should say. Because you would have a, a real fight on your hands then. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Okay, we're good. I thought someone were gonna get poisoned there, but we're good. We are good. And there we go. Oh! Shoot, some... Oh, I jumped in a little bit too early there, that was my own fault. And, you know what, I'm gonna lead him away from this side. It's not wide enough for my comfort. <laughs> since, it, since it lost the water cannon, and don't worry, it won't pick up stuff that it uh, dropped off like other dweevils would, uh, but since it lost the water cannon, it's it's pretty much done, <laughs> I guess you could say, because we don't have to worry about these guys here now, and uh, uh, we can always call Pikmin back uh, from the other elements, so we don't have to worry about that. Uh, captains are resistant to its elements as well, so it's not that big of a deal. Alright, I'll, I'll attack anything that I can get, I guess, here. Yep, uh-oh, 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 that's not good, that's not good! <laughs> uh, okay, yeah, there's only a couple exits to, uh, to this area. Wait, where's some... Did I hear some Pikmin choking? No? Okay. I thought I heard some... in there. And, you know, you know that sound that they make. It was clearly not the sound that I made, but you know that sound they make. <laughs> oh, come on. Oh, 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 fire time! Yeah! Yeah, always watch its color to be able to tell what attack it's using. I'm sure you're familiar with the colors already, so be able to move by instinct by now. I should say move out of the way by instinct by now. Okay, knock off one of its suckers. Ah, poopers. Ah, poopers. Yep. Yeah. No, oh, there, there, there we go. <laughs> don't don't carry the treasure yet. I'm not ready. <laughs> yeah, you can keep doing that electricity all day. I don't mind. <laughs> as long as you're not doing anything that's uh, gonna harm my yellows, I am okay with that. And that's gonna harm the yellows, so I am not okay with that. <laughs> but yeah, it's just the boss of patience. It's not really all that hard. Just take your time. Just relax. Get out of the way when it's going to do stuff. And yeah, I mean, when it's going to do stuff that's going to hurt your Pikmin. And uh, maybe I should spray up just to speed this along here. Because I don't want to bore you too much by uh, taking too long. <laughs> After all. Knock off. Dang it. <laughs> yeah. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Actually, maybe I should do is. Oops. Oh, yeah, that's right. Uh, uh. Captains are still hurt by that. I forgot about that. Okay, we're good. <laughs> See, it's not that big of a deal if Pikmin get mass choking or mass burning or anything like that because you could just call them back like that. It's not it's not a scary uh, sort of kind of boss if you know what to do. But if you don't, well, you're going to probably lose a lot of Pikmin. <laughs> Here comes the poison. Uh-oh, uh-oh. 
Uh, uh, me, uh. It's it's really that monster. Oh, you got poison. It's really that monster pump that makes this boss fight hard because you have to keep um, keeping track of all your Pikmin across the entire field. It also shakes Pikmin off very frequently, which is uh, quite a hindrance. <laughs> kind of like, yeah, yeah. yeah. All right, let's just, yeah, good, good. Oh, I shoot! I I blew the whistle too wide. <laughs> I right, knock that bomb off. Ah, poopers. All right, get out, get out, get out. Wait, I'll shoot too late. <laughs> Stay um within the ring of the poison if you get caught up in it. Otherwise, yeah, you're gonna get whacked a little bit there. Yeah, yeah. Oh, 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 oh. oh. Ah, I lost four. Ah, poopers. Yep. Oh, ah, poopers. <laughs> Just trying to speed it along here, and I'm getting impatient. Too impatient for my own good here. <laughs> okay, we're clear. We're clear. Go, 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 attack. That the backside and finally knock off one of these things. Ah. Uh, yeah, well, I mean, I knocked off the water pump, but I mean, what I mean is knock off another one of these things. Come on, knock it off. Knock it off. Yes! Another one is down. Now we just have ye old flamethrower. Wait, did I get the flame? Oh, yeah, I forgot I got the flamethrower. Okay. So, we. That means this boss is done. <laughs> it cannot harm Pikmin at all now. Well, at least, you know, the yellow Pikmin that I'm using here, because all it's got is electricity. It can, however, harm captains, so... I suppose you gotta look out for that. But as long as you are, um... You know, clearing stuff out like this, and you, you've got some decent dodging skills, I don't think it's going to defeat the captains. Oh, it just increased the power of its, uh... Of its attack there. As I said, when it's, uh... When the uh, uh, ob objects of torment get lower on HP, it starts to use them more aggressively. They get more powerful. So yeah, like ah. <laughs> see how little damage it does to captains there. That's why I say it's it's not really a threat to captains. Yeah, but what is a threat to a captain anyway? <laughs> like, let's be honest here. <laughs> and actually, it's not really doing any damage. Come to think of it, it's just like stunning the captain because he's being touched by it, but it's not doing any damage because of that eraser. <laughs> That's good. It's very good. <laughs> All right. Oh, yeah! It's done! And now, as you see, its protective shield is gone. And by the way, it can also... I mean, right now, it can't do any damage to Pikmin whatsoever now. So if you'd like to, you can grab your squad and uh, take them in here. <laughs> Let's just... Uh, Wipe it out with purples, I guess, because his body is going to be hanging towards the ground now, uh, for the most part. So, purple time! It has, it still has a lot of HP, though, so it's, well, okay, it doesn't have that much HP. Good lord. <laughs> Alright, that was quick. <laughs> Woo! Oh, yeah! Oh! Completion. Actually, maybe not completion, because I, I think I'm one treasure so short somewhere. Somewhere. <laughs> Louis? Are your life functions fading? No, he appears to have only fainted. He's always running into trouble. Instruct the Pikmin to carry him. There's not enough room for him in the cockpit anymore. <laughs> She's too full of treasure. You'll have to keep him in the cargo hold. I mean, uh, yeah, you get what I'm saying here, because the, the captain is with us, excuse me. Alright, so, let's, uh, well, I'll carry him back last. <laughs> it only takes one Pikmin to carry him back. Uh, let's, I suppose, where's my purples here? There we go. <laughs> purples, help carry this stuff back. Quite a bit, because this is uh, some pretty heavy stuff. And yeah, let's just uh, keep throwing them around here, I guess. And, uh, hey, you, go, you guys, get on here. And, yeah, yeah, everyone, everyone on those. Get, get on those treasures, including Louie. <laughs> Just have him come back last. And there we go, everything's on. <laughs> All right, so let's see the names of these suckers, finally. Ah, uh, yes. The final boss has been bested. <laughs> what you got? What you got? Flare Cannon! How did I not remember the name of that? <laughs> oh, whatever. Okay, what's the name of this? 
Uh, what's some electric? No, what I know that for sure. Shock. Oh yeah, I remember now. Shock therapist. <laughs> That's a, the electricity thing that I left for last because it doesn't harm yellows. Here comes the comedy bomb and monster pump, as well as Louie. Come on. Come on. Wah! Comedy bomb first. Ooh, 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 ooh. Yep, comedy bomb. <laughs> Come on, monster pump. Get in there before Louie. Oh, I think Louie beat it back. They it actually did beat it back. Dang it, I wanted him to be the last treasure. <laughs> it's okay, though. He's worth 10 pokos for some reason, and he's the king of bugs. <laughs> yeah, he actually counts as a treasure. Woo! Oh, yeah. Woo! Woo monster pump. Alright, I don't think I've 100% uh, of the game, though. I think I'm missing something. I must have missed something on another floor. So, let's get out of here and see what I missed. At least I think I uh, missed something, because I only got five treasures there, and I'm pretty sure there were six left. So, yeah! Final boss completed, though! Woo! <laughs> wow, she's the final boss beaten, though. So, yeah, there we go. Woo! Let's see here what all this treasure is worth. Yeah, see, I mean, I'm missing something somewhere on this place. 20, 20 out of 21. And, oh, it's kind of funny that they are showing the uh, last number there. Maybe because it's the last dungeon, we know how many treasures are uh, down at and whatnot. Alright, so... What, what, what did I miss and where? <laughs> I guess we will find out, huh? Just as long as we aren't transported back to the, uh, uh, the, the end, like, right away. But I don't think that is going to happen. So, yeah, I gotta go back over to the, uh, dream then. But what, what do I have in my squad here to, uh, swap around, I guess you could say? Let's, let's get some more blues, I guess, because I lost a bunch of blues on that one floor. So, yeah, I guess I'll grab those, and I'll see you back when I find whatever treasure it is I happen to miss again. I don't know why I keep missing stuff, it's so weird. <laughs> oh, I just killed the antenna beetle here at sub-level 12, and it appears that I missed something. Oh, ho, ho, but where is it? <laughs> Maybe not on this side, because... There doesn't seem to be anything reacting uh, over on this side, but yeah, we're going to see, I suppose. By the way, the strategy of just rushing over to the exit, really handy in the dream den. You know, that is, if you don't need to get anything. <laughs> Getting stuff is a uh, big factor in the difficulty of dungeons. I should say underground areas. Uh, is there something behind there? I can't really see. There might... Yeah, it looks like there is... Oh, uh-oh. 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 <laughs> eh. Okay, we're good. <laughs> uh, uh, oh, oh, they're done. Okay. Now let's knock this down, and it's probably something buried on the ground, which is why he wasn't, I didn't notice it, because I wasn't paying attention to the treasure radar again. Probably. Who knows? <laughs> so let's see here. Is there... What? Oh, what? Uh-oh. It's on... That side of the wall? So it's not this wall, it's the one, of course, in front of the orange bulb orb. <laughs> Why wouldn't it be? <laughs> Let's get the, our whole squad here and uh, see what we have to do. Well, I mean, yeah, there's a couple of uh, Pikmin left in that other room, but I mean the whole squad of purples. And I guess other colors, in case we need them. <laughs> yep. Okay. Let's do this right away, right off the bat, and we're good. Alright, now, let's not attract the Wallywog in a place that I can't recover from. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, wait, 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 hold on, hold on, I don't have purples. There we go! <laughs> Always gotta have those purples to keep the pressure on them. Alright, now, I should, keyword should, be able to... I'm actually glad they grabbed that, because I threw a purple in with that. I mean, a, a, a blue in with that, excuse me. Oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. 
Okay, we're good. <laughs> Alright, I just think I, this is all I need to clear this out with. Uh, the rest... Oh, shoot. Got a blue in there. Dang it! Stop getting in with the whites, blues! Mm -mm. Good. <laughs> yeah, leave them to knock that out while I put the rest on this wall. And there should be something hidden underground. Maybe. Yep, okay. <laughs> How did I not notice the treasure radar? I don't know. Some of the things I've not noticed in this walkthrough are just amazing. <laughs> Alright. Looks like the final ring of the game. The final treasure of the game. Only it should have been Louie. It should have been Louie. But he ended up being like third final. Of all the ones that I've collected. Alright, let's get this knocked out. Wait, actually, where's the exit? Oh yeah, that's right. It's on the other side. I'm being stupid again. Today's not my day, is it? Because <laughs> I recorded this the day I recorded the uh, other day. Which is what I mean here. <laughs> Uh, the last part is what I'm saying, yeah. So, this Titan Dweevil day, as well as the last part I recorded in one day, and the last part is the one that I missed this ring in, and thus, it's the same day. Got it, good! I finally was able to explain that universal calm. And now, the treasure in the, in <laughs> the treasures in the game are now 100%ed, and I've got to find the way out of here. Is there any sorts of geysers on this floor? No, so it looks like I'm going to have to continue until I find a geyser. Hopefully it won't be until the uh, final boss floor, though. That would be kind of, kind of sucky, but yeah. <laughs> anyway, let's just uh, find an exit, I suppose. Eh. It looks like I ended up going down the floor 15 anyway. There wasn't any geysers, but that's okay, because the floor is completely cleared out anyway. I mean, it, it doesn't, it won't be able to reuse its weapons for obvious reasons, so thus, the Titan Dweevil is not back to its full potential. But it is back! <laughs> See, it doesn't have its attacks and whatnot, so we could, uh, I suppose, kill it off if you'd like to, but I don't know, this just kind of seems mean at this point, because it's completely defenseless. <laughs> Poor thing. It just... It doesn't stand a chance. <laughs> Especially when I can use purples on it. I'm so sorry, Titan Dweevil. But I'm not really all that sorry. <laughs> I guess it's another Titan Dweevil, because the other one dissolved too. Yeah, I don't think uh, they could revive after something like that happens to them. <laughs> okay, let's get out of here. And finish up this game once and for all. Well, okay, there's still more to go. You know, challenge mode and stuff like that. <laughs> Woo! 100% complete! Yeah! <laughs> and not a day extra! <laughs> Yeah, no Pikmin lost, because I just ran through the caves, you know, without battling stuff for the most part. So, yeah. And the stuff that I had to battle was pretty easy. Alright! Game! 100%! Woohoo! Well, story mode. <laughs> oh, yeah! It's been a long journey, but we did it. Yeah! <laughs> Excitement! The fireflies, they are gathering in one place! No, it's not fireflies, I know. <laughs> I'm just joking around here. Goodbye, Pikmin. Goodbye. We will never see you again, unfortunately. Especially Louis, since, he's, since he fell asleep and now he's in the treasure hold. <laughs> ah, this game has quite a beautiful atmosphere to it, despite its many dangers. Oh! 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 Hmm. What could that be? Those couldn't be Pikmin, could they? Hmm. I mean, there's different colors that we've never seen before in there, I think. Maybe. <laughs> Actually, it looked like there were some different colors in there. Unless it was just the 
as they were coming in, and I caught a brief glimpse of them, I don't know. <laughs> anyway, we're done. I'm done babbling. Okay, but I'm not done. <laughs> yeah, I know, I, I said that multiple times here, just to joke around. I joke around a lot in my videos, in case you didn't realize that. <laughs> Woo! P I K M I N 2! That spells. I don't know. <laughs> I'm kidding. The end! But it's not really the end. Again. <laughs> ah! It took a while to get off that the end screen, but here are the results! For my 100%ed save file. Not counting restarts. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, I just cut ahead a little bit with that V end there because it was kind of kind of preposterous how long they made me wait there. <laughs> so, there's the, there's the statistics. Oh, yeah. And we're done with the game story mode. It was fun! Love making this walkthrough! So much! I love Pikmin too, it's my favorite in the Pikmin series. And it takes us back here for some reason. <laughs> and with that, I'm gonna end off the part here. I hope you enjoy, and I'll see you in the next part when I show you some extras!